very much. Uh, I get to know a lot of the people here. This is my fifth year here. It's the fourth year for the uh, film festival, but there was a year before prepping it. And so I came in, and I was lucky enough through my friend Lavin to invite me to meet Mopo, Kurt, and start this process happening. You guys can switch sides. <laughs> but when my category here tonight is best overall, and I know at any film festival, large, medium, small, you're not going to see every film. And we do, I do, like the, the acting uh, uh, award presenter, had to see all the films, so did I. There were shorts, documentaries, features, every category. And I know as audience members, you're not, you're not gonna see them all. Because you can only see so much and you get burnt out yourself watching all these films. So you pick and you choose, and you pick and you choose. But what I found in this year's overall selection is a theme that every voice, young, old, beginner, amateur, professional, is that we better wake up. Because there's a lot of things that are happening that we are starting to hear. And I'm seeing it in this voice. And that's what this film festival provides, is a voice. And I, we all know what's going on. But again, it made me aware that after seeing all these films, no politicians involved, nothing involved. I'm just saying we better wake up because that's what the theme of this whole, all these films were. There were love stories, there was political stories, but it's the voices that we're hearing that are, that are that's, that's, what's, that's what's making it contemporary. So there's a lot of major films I got, I got to see. I love them all, I love the process. I'm a filmmaker myself. I enjoy that process so much. And I was honored because I just did a trailer that I promoted for, uh, for, for, for some investors and they allowed me to screen it here uh, opening night at the gala. And it was called Awesome Girl. You leave us alone. You know you ain't leaving these kids. Get me! Run, Tizzy, run! Get, him. Get back here! And, uh, and it was the first time, we just finished cutting it, it was the first time it was presented, so it allowed me to present my voice, to hear it for the first time in front of a good audience like this, and, and I think it was well received. So I want to thank you guys for that opportunity as well. And, and this is a, all film, film, film festivals are different. And I just want to do an honorary, honorary mention to a young lady who I want to, he was here. And Gail, can you stand up for Consider Love? Can you stand up? Are you up here? Is Gail here? Oh, she must have just left. Okay. Uh, I wanted to wish her good luck because uh, she's a young, up-and-coming writer, and I saw her outside talking, promoting her work, and I thought she was still here, so I just want to say good luck to you and keep writing because it's going to happen for you. Okay? So the film that I chose as best overall and last year was a short, which was uh, Dial's Bound, which I thought was lovely. It had a great message as well. And this year, I want to choose a feature film. And to me, I thought it was fun. I thought it was courageous. It's contemporary. It makes a statement. It's fun. You can tell the actors had a great time working on it. I'm going to go with Becoming Bolesk. You have turned your back on Islam. There's more than one way to be a Muslim. There is one way, the way written in the Quran. My private self cannot be hidden or revealed with clothing because I'm more than just skin. I'm your brother. You're not going to be a stripper. I forbid it. Not strippers. Thank you very much. <laughs>